different woman show. Yes, we are finally here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I just want to keep saying it. The different woman show. The different woman show. The different woman show. <laughs> yes, this is the relaunch. This is the rebirth. This is the reinvention of the Different Woman Show. I am so excited. I am so blessed to have the show back again on this footing. Hmm. It's been a slow progress. It's been a slow movement to where we are right now. But I wouldn't trade any of it. As the Yorubas of Nigeria would say, when a bull within a fight runs back, he's not running from that fight. No, he's only going to recharge, re-energize, and come back to finish that fight. Yes, that is what the show has done. It is all about the bounce back, the resilience, the power to come back. Yes, we are back. Let's take a look at our previous episodes and enjoy the journey to where we are right now. This is the Different Woman. This and is the Different Woman Show. Welcome to another exciting, interesting, scintillating episode of the Different Woman Show. This is yes. the Different Woman Show. My name is Sandra and I am the Different Woman. Welcome to the Different Woman Show. This happens every Tuesday night by 8 p.m. Another interesting, exciting, scintillating episode. Oh, this is the different woman show of course welcome to the different woman show and welcome to another scintillating exciting edition of the different woman show welcome to the different woman show welcome 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 to another exciting interesting scintillating episode of the different woman show Ooh, i am ashamed but no i'm not <laughs> I am actually proud of the level we have grown. It shows growth. It shows that yes, we are constantly improving on ourselves. That's one thing we can also assure you of. We might be making slow progress, but we will keep making progress. So, this is a storytelling talk show focused on the woman's business, life and style. It is all about the woman on the show, the full package. Yes, it is not about all the flawlessness or perfection or expectations of the society. No, we're bringing it to you raw, mm -hmm. as it is. We want you to get to learn the woman, to understand the woman, to realize that she's also human and her rights are human rights. Over time, the woman has been taught to be everything else but the owner of her story. And that's why the show is here today. This show gives the woman an opportunity to own her spotlight and use her voice to share her stories. This enables her to be remembered the way she wants to be remembered. Yes, that's why I am doing the show. Because I know that there are a lot of women out there, a lot of young girls out there dreaming, whose dreams might fade away without inspiration from other women like them to see that they're not alone in this world. That's why this show is important. And that's why I keep fighting. That's why I keep doing this. That's why I keep bringing to you the stories of women. Speaking about storytelling, before I introduce you to most of my guests, who you will get to see over the course of this season, why don't I introduce you to me, the different woman, yes, here is a piece of my story. My name is Sandra Adeyayibelo. I am the founder and creative director of the Different Woman Network. The Different Woman Network is a multimedia and events agency based in Nigeria. Through this agency, I am able to merge my passion for gender and mind wellness with my career in the media. I have always believed in the power and potential of the media to create social impact. And that's why most of the productions I engage in are geared towards influencing behavioral change. My journey began several years ago as a secondary survivor of domestic violence. I watched my mother suffer for several years in the hands of her husband. Back then when I asked my mother why she stayed in such abusive relationship, she would always ask me the question, what am I supposed to do? Where do I go to? Where do I start from? How do I start? These questions right now are the benchmark for most of the projects that I have engaged in. 
earlier in my life I wrote a book it's a collection of poems called woman the poems in that book are dedicated to celebrating women all over going forward I have created several projects get towards uniting women helping women support one another studying theater arts the in university and also practicing um, from radio TV print I have been able to develop my form of expression to to find and develop my own voice the projects I engage in mostly have helped me to discover myself, accept myself, and of course, embrace the scars that I inherited from my childhood. Through the Different Women Network, I've been able to engage with several women, creating impactful entertainment and events. One of such projects that we engaged in on the Different Women Network is creating the WEMPAR program. Yes, the WEMPAR program is a program that has empowered close to 50 women with landed properties in Abuja, Nigeria. Yes, the traditional African society has always had the group contribution um, network. So people come together, Akawo, Osusu, you know, to put monies together for individual or group projects. This has been a thing in the society for so long. And I looked at it, a lot of women engage in such activities only to end up buying or spending on liabilities we, so we're able to rebrand the concept of osusu of akawo to get women to put monies together and buy lands together to enable them have properties in their names of course in most african societies today most women don't even know that they could own properties because even from your um, background most times they say the woman is not allowed to inherit properties because she would go off and get married and so on so she mostly is deprived of both her father's and her husband's properties so part of what we were trying to do was to rebrand the concept and educate women on the um, the positive side the the benefit of owning properties of preparing for the rainy day I have always believed that a woman will be able to solve her own problems and I believe that when women can come together to you know discover themselves they'll be able to do so much more that's why I wrote this e-work book answers it is a self-discovery book that um, appeals to all kinds of women it's written in simple grammar and it's dedicated to helping the woman rediscover herself fall back in love with herself you know accept herself and take care of herself because no one can give from an empty cup so we want to refill the woman with those dreams those visions those joy the energy that used to burn within her that's what this book helps her to do i also offered one-on-one -on -one counseling and finally i decided to focus more on creating digital content um films documentaries and i also launched uh, an emotional and financial empowerment podcast live on LinkedIn. It happens every Sunday night by 1900 WAT. And finally, I am launching this show, The Different Woman Show. Yes, The Different Woman Show has been existing for a couple of years now, but it was mostly focused on spotlighting um, business women. But right now, the relaunch is focusing on spotlighting every woman. Most of the women's contributions go untold or unnoticed in our society and that's why I am relaunching the show to spotlight ordinary women doing extraordinary things. The plan is to empower more women to own their voices, to own their spotlights and to share their stories. We want to be able to celebrate with you and cry with you. We know, I know personally about isolation and that's why this right here, this show especially is geared towards building a community where women are more than the hashtags. Yes. So come with me and let's do this together. This show is for you. This show is for us. Let's support one another. from diverse women yes women from different backgrounds locations um, industries women from all around the world we're going to be hearing from them and of course variety is the spice of life 
if the Almighty wanted us to be the same, He would have created us the same. The same color, the same hair, the same size, you know? Everything the same, but no. Variety is the spice of life. It is that diversity that we're bringing to the different woman show. <laughs> I am so excited. I hope you can see it. I am very excited because, hmm, the stories of the women that we will be introducing to you, these women have survived. These women are survivors. These women are thriving. These women are making impact. And yes, the world needs to know about them. The world needs to hear them. This show is bound, is focused on amplifying the voices of women in our society. So if you know a woman that needs to be on the show, that needs to tell her stories, hey, I want to sit down with her, I want to talk to her, if you're such a woman. Hey, reach out to me and let's have a chat. Now, I want to introduce you to some of the friends of the Different Women Show. Let's hear what they've got to say about this new journey that we've decided to take on. You too, Sandra. You do amazing. You. Uh, your project, the LinkedIn Five Side Chats. You too. I always take my time to go watch the episodes later. And you're doing a beautiful job. I, I, I hope and pray that you get all the exposure that you need because this is an amazing initiative. Super single world. The ability to just share and the goal of helping people to understand what a woman's walk really looks like. That is so powerful and so meaningful because I think we've been, we've been, I don't want to say necessarily put down, in some ways put down, but in other ways just mis not understood, right? Which has led us to then not necessarily understand each other. And me personally, I think more importantly than having the men understand us, because I don't know that men ever necessarily like I will never fully understand a man right and so I want to be respected and, and cared and right <clears throat> but I really believe that as we hear each other's stories that we we can do a better job as women supporting each other we don't have to be we don't have to be judgmental we don't have to be threatened even women can listen to other women's stories and learn that, oh, you know, just because what you show on social media is good and maybe I want that, doesn't mean that that's really your life. And oh, you do have feelings like I have feelings. And oh, you do have struggles like I have struggles. And so I think that's, that's the most powerful part for me. I can tell you right now when I heard <clears throat> the, 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 um, that you were relaunching the Different Women show, I was really excited and what I'm really excited about doing is getting to know all of the women that you are going to interview and um, having them share the, uh, the three different aspects of life that you that you are um, going to explore with them and just hearing their perspective. It's, a, it's one thing to just have your own thought on something, but when you hear other people and not, not only just other people different women women are the backbone i the backbone to a lot of things in this world and if we don't continue to walk and talk and do because we're also doers but if we don't continue to do our world will continue to um or decline so I'm just excited about hearing all of the different women and I appreciate you for um, one, relaunching it and um, and being a different woman yourself. When you hear words like this, you know you're doing something right. You know you are on the right path. I do not take any of you for granted. I do not take this journey for granted. I do not take the stories of the women who have entrusted me with them for granted. No, I truly appreciate you all. I appreciate your trust. I appreciate the efforts. I appreciate everyone who has put in the work to make sure that we are where we are today. 
thank you so much for believing in me, for believing in this show, for trusting us to deliver. Thank you so much for your calls, for your emails, for checking up. Hey, thank you. Thank you so much because of you, we have a show. Hey, the journey just began. The work just began. This is an opportunity for you to let it out loud. Tell people about this show. Spread the word about the Different Women Show because, hey, we are back.